Hello and welcome back to Smoothcraft. Before we start, hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. In today's Minecraft video, we're back on the Minecraft Pocket Edition, the Bedrock version, because I've got something that I think you will enjoy. Today I bring you hardcore game mode, but for the Minecraft Pocket Edition, the Bedrock version. There's just something about having one life and one life only in Minecraft that the community is fully enjoying. Going back to 2020, yeah, that year everyone was enjoying hardcore, and in 2021 it's still incredibly popular. Now as I'm making this video by default, the Bedrock version doesn't have this game mode along with like 200 other features, but I want to give a massive shout out to Jessa101. Let's go through the basic details that you need to know. Here just to create a world now I'm just going to call mine hardcore world um. For this, I am going to put in creative for the sake of this tutorial, but we will switch it to survival as well. The difficulty he mentioned is that you don't need to change it too hard, because by default this will change it to hard mode, but if you just want it to be extra, I don't know, safe put it to hard mode um. I believe in hardcore mode you don't get a starting map or a bonus chest, so they are disabled. The perfect seed for today's video. Show coordinates I'm gonna have that on. Don't know if you need to have experimental on, but we're gonna put them on and I'm gonna turn on the education edition because he mentioned turning the education edition on. Once you've done that, go to behaviors packs. You'll have this hardcore mode ultimate, BP which is the behaviors pack, and it explains a couple of details about this created by Jessa101, again full shout out to him, his channel is down below. Once you enable this, the resource pack will automatically enable on itself. That being said, we're now good to go to the game and to check this out. So I'm not gonna lie, we got a pretty good seed, we start inside plains, we have a friendly pig, we have dark oak, we have a village over there, and we've got more, well, we've got a dessert over. Here, yeah, pretty good seed. So if you want to uh, use this seed, you're going to have to type in the seed because something else that's missing from this version is forward slash seed as well. So the first thing you will notice is my hearts are now hardcore. As for my hunger being cookies and my RGB XP and my portal hotbot, that's a separate add-on. I'll try and leave it down below if I can remember, but I've showed you guys that multiple times. So there's a couple of things that you want to do when you start this. If you have any problems at all, you want to type in forward slash function HM, which is hardcore mode dash help. This will teach you the very, very basics. Behind this, it says if you die, you can use the forward slash command function HM respawn to resurrect and live again. Also, if you enable education in the world setting spectator players, then spectators players who die can fly. So when you die in this, it's pretty much game over. Yes, there is a command to resurrect yourself, but by default, you're dead. Once you die, it is officially game over. Now I believe there are multiple death messages depending on how you die, but for the sake of this, we're just gonna kill ourselves as a standard. Let me try and think of, you know, what I think I'm gonna die by a cactus, so let's slowly kill myself. Death by cactus, and as you guys can see, this pops up. The real Echo was pricked to death, the real Echo died and can no longer respawn. Now when you die, you're basically in spectator mode, you are completely invisible. I got a feeling people could use this for trolling as well, so it wouldn't surprise me if people find another thing to do with this. Now by default, as soon as you die to have all of this, you have speed 2 jumps, 5 resistance, fire resistance, invisibility night, the vision you pretty much have all the abilities because you're dead and they're just gonna go to help you. So it simply says you spect, I don't even know which yeah it says, you're spectating because you're dead again in Minecraft Hardcore, if you die you're dead, you're completely dead. Now if we go to my inventory, we're invisible like we're not part of this world anymore, your whole thing is here, it says the barrier, cannot move, items cannot be moved, so you can't grab or drop or move or change these at all. It says can't move items, can't be moved, drop, remove, crafted with. We also have this, the Elytra, you can't move these, but you can use these. So you've got the Elytra, we have feather, we have milk, we have a golden apple, and we have a compass. That's all for today, I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you never miss any amazing video from us.